Hey everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Loot Patrol. We are playing some more Resident Evil 8 because we are going to beat this thing. And we've got questions. Chris Redfield is here now. Ethan is dead. No spoilers, because you should have seen the last episode. And if this is your first episode, spoilers. Sorry. And if you didn't watch the last episode, then uh, you deserve it. There you go. <laughs> you do. Go back and watch it. <laughs> Oh, okay. Here's the gigantic hole that we're going down into. I found a way down. I'm going in. The rest of you stay back. <laughs> Everyone else stay back. This is for me. Just me. The genome editing we saw in the E series. The stuff originated here. Okay, got everything. Got everything. Devil snare, devil snare. <laughs> oh. Spiky ball. Oh wait. I got a tough guy here. I'm gonna need backup. You just told everyone not to come in. You're on the ground. There's an opening in the roof. Use it. Okay, I'm moving out. All right then. Hold on until I get there. Okay. Yeah, we'll just hold on. Ooh. Woo -hoo. See, you can play Dark Souls. Do just fine. Whoa. Dead yet. It's like his big hammer on the end there is like a burr. Like a little spiky thing you get in the bush. Yeah. This is kind of what it looks like. Oh no! You're a fool! my horses oh that guy's skin's going away yeah ah, there it is Whew. Ooh. giant Chris. rest of you stay above ground you know Ethan, if you're playing as Chris, Chris are you gonna be able to sell things to the big old fat guy I don't know so Resident Evil 7 had a similar um, kind of like step away uh, where you were playing as Ethan the whole time, and then you actually played as a flashback where you played as Mia and you saw her mission with Evelyn and everything, hmm. and she had an assault rifle. But it was a flashback, so it made you know you w eventually went back to playing as Ethan. Figure that out later. Um, Focus on. But I don't remember what happened with the inventory. I think once you were back to the inventory. What is that? I don't know. It's the Mega My Cetus. Oh my god, you're right. Alpha the squad. I've That's not myself. Rose, is it? So now we can end this mess after all. I freaking hope not. About damn time. And two explosives armed. There's enough there to blow the whole village sky high. Let's get out of here and blow the damn place. Not before I end Miranda. I'm not taking any more chances. I'm going in. Roger that. Standing by. Or you could blow it sky high and then see if Miranda's like still there afterwards. Keep your distance. That's an option. Do not move until I give the order. I know it's too late now, but Gosh. We really should have told Ethan the plan. Yeah, you think? We didn't expect Miranda to act so soon. Even so, you should have told him. Yeah. 
Well, I like that guy putting putting Chris in his place. Yeah. This must be Miranda's lab. Oh boy, there's a lot to lot to unpack in here. Yeah. Ooh, okay. Donna Beneviento. All right. So it looks like these are kind of the stories of uh, the people. So I'll go ahead and just kind of freeze frame on them for a second so that you guys can uh, read them. Pause the video and read them if you would like. Do, do, do. Poor fish boy. Poor fish boy. Dimitrescu. Okay. All right. Do, 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 do. I wonder how, how much like. No way. Spencer. So Spencer was. Uh, the Spencer Manor was the very first uh, Resident Evil game. Hmm. And he was the one who, and I'm sure I'm, I'm getting this mixed up a little bit, um, but he was the one who, like, initially created the T-Virus, if I recall, not as a weapon, but more as a means to, like, prolong life. And then the Raccoon City outbreak happened. Show me your hands! Umbrise, this is Alpha. Where is Miranda right now? Still at the ceremony site. Whatever she's doing, she's staying put. God damn. It really is you. I'm glad you saved me. Why are you here? Mm. I was caught in Houston experiments. Wait, did you say Mia? Mia Winters? In the flesh. We're in the exact same outfit. Uh, yeah. Get distracted. Stick Me only had one outfit. <laughs> she just wore. What if you this is Miranda? You and the Miranda you. at the ceremony site is actually you Mia. You would keep us safe. We did everything that you yeah. asked. Yeah. We moved over here, everything. And I didn't care. So long as we were together. Oh, yikes. So you tell me. Where is my husband? Where is my daughter? Ethan is gone. Oh. I couldn't save him. But I can save Rose. <laughs> Come on. It's not safe here after all. What do you mean he's gone? He's dead. I'm sorry, Mia, but we have to leave. We have to destroy this village. No! You're wrong. I tried to keep this a secret, but... Ooh, a big reveal. You don't understand how special he is. Hmm. Now we're gonna go back to playing as Ethan. Hey, yep, it looks like. <laughs> I like how she's like, oh, his fingers are back with his ring. So it's there. And this, this is like a dream sequence. Yeah. Sorry, uh, Ethan. You died and went to hell. How did I get here? God, it's freezing. This shit in my body. What's wrong with your body, Ethan? It's very cold. That's what's wrong. That makes sense. It's a little hard to walk without a heart. Ellen, how are you here? The 
her dead. <laughs> dead? Uh, I mean, Miranda. She. Uh, no. I still have to save Rose. Uh. Wrong! <laughs> it wasn't Miranda. You were always dead. What are you saying? I can still. Uh, Wait, has he been a zombie the whole fucking time? You mean Maybe. You think it was weird? No matter how much you got hurt. Remember. I'm really glad that they're tying this back in. Messing with my head. You shouldn't be walking. Screw <laughs> you! I love Ethan's attitude towards stuff sometimes. Me too. I, 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 I did all that. Rose. Mia. Is that why Rose has like superpowers or whatever? Because oh, because Ethan had, Ethan had the zombie dick. Yes, he had gross zombie sex with Mia, and Mia's oh, just like you don't know how special he is, Chris. He's undead. Your whole body is nothing, whole body is nothing but mold. mold. Oh. He's a mold man. He's the mold man. No. Rose. I have to save my daughter. You're already dead. Dead. <laughs> I, I will <laughs> save Rose. I'm glad that they like made a reason as to why he can just survive his limbs getting cut off and stuff. Yeah. I'll save you no matter what. What's funny is they did such a good job of not having loading screens throughout this whole game that like now that I'm seeing loading screens, it feels weird. Uh. Oh, we're in Fat yeah. Boy's meat shack. At last, he awakes. Where am I? My carriage, Ethan. You were having a nightmare. Duke? Your battle with Heisenberg was a sight to see. But to think Miranda would show herself. How long have I been out? Not long till dawn. Duke, I need a favor. Take me to Miranda. I assumed as much and I'm already on the way. Good good job, Duke. You should arrive shortly. Thanks, Duke. Thank you. All right, can I buy a grenade launcher? <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure of this? Your body is, well, falling apart. Yeah, we've noticed. Yes. Foolish of me to ask. Speaking of foolish questions, who or what are you? <laughs> Even I can't quite answer that. We're here. I owe you one. So if I'm a mold man... I'm afraid you can't return to your old world any longer. Oh. Are you ready? Yeah, I have to be. 
So something tells me that Ethan's not gonna quite make it out of this game. <laughs> yeah. I gotta go. Can I, can I, can I buy some stuff? Is that? I mean, do we really uh, need they're, first they're aid They're prepping anymore? you. Like, they're prepping you for that boss fight. Do you have sufficient weapons and items? We're gonna see, buddy. We are gonna see. We are for sure gonna fully upgrade these because when dexterous. I play back through this, I want to have one weapon with infinite ammo. Might as well be your trusty, dusty pistol. Oh, yeah. Ooh. I wish. Oh, hey. Shotgun's completely upgraded, too. So I'll have nice, nice, nice supplies. All right. Actually, let's see what we can because sell. Because of all this commotion, I've lost an entire territory to transact in. It's really damp. Oh, right. oh, the assemblage of life and so let's trade all that. I can feel Lord Heisenberg's essence through it. <laughs> Supplies. We're gonna go ahead. If this is the last fight, might as well be stocked. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know yeah, what I'm for saying? sure. The final fight. Why you'd be interested in that? Ooh, should we? All right, let's move some stuff around. At least I'll let you rotate stuff. That's good. That is good. Got a lot of sniper rifle bolts. Just, just stay there now. There we go. Oh yeah, we're we're good. <laughs> I hope this one makes itself useful. All right. All stocked up. Yeah, let me just make sure I can't make anything. I don't think I can. This Ooh. may be our last. Please be well. All right, Duke. Thanks. It's been fun. I'm sorry for all the things I've said about you. It was mean. Whew. Want to know what the worst part about this is? We're going to have to fight them on the next episode. We are going to have to fight them on the next episode of Loot Patrol. So we will see you guys next time see and you on the next one i think we're gonna be finishing this thing up so see yeah. you later